thank you so much for the opportunity to talk about this fascinating film. I loved it. I love your character. I love what you did with your character. So right off the bat, what, what is your take about the concept of power? Because this film presents the, the concept of power from many different perspectives, from the, the queen that wants want to achieve her goals, uh, the, the lead character, and even the dragon uh, uh, with, with, you know, wanting to control uh, 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 there's some revenge and vengeance about it. What, what, what can you say about the concept of power? Well, when Juan Carlos basically described how this was going to be different from the conventional fairy tale that we're all used to, okay. um, he tapped into that very thing. It's okay. what is the kind of power that this young woman mm -hmm. is going to possess? It's a survival story. It is. And it's her on her own, right? Mm -hmm. So we go on this journey with her and uh, justice is finally served. So that is, I think, in answer to your question, that's the power is that she gets the justice. Excellent. Now that you mentioned Juan Carlos, um, and considering that you're also a, a, a director, uh, you've directed the beautiful film Land, um, what were those, those conversations with Juan Carlos uh, from director to director about some specific, probably complicated sequence, more, mostly from the director perspective? <laughs> no, he, he pretty much had his film laid out in uh, shot lists of every scene. And I loved just hearing from him. Like, How are you going to shoot that scene? <laughs> uh, because a lot of it is CGI, of course. Okay, yes. You know, so you have to pretend mm -hmm. that there is a cave that's 100 feet down. Or you have to... Um, and it's just always interesting to to pick their brain and be like, what lens are you using and why? And yeah. Excellent, excellent, thank yeah. you for that. I also find very fascinating um, and somehow unusual for this type of film, the use of two villains, mm -hmm. uh, the queen and, and the dragon. How were the, the, the dynamics of approaching your character without neglecting the main conflict between the damsel and the queen? Well, they both are doing very immoral things for a very good cause, uh -huh. right? <laughs> <I agree with laughs> so, you. Not much more to say on that one. Uh, as, as a mother of grown children, what, what was it like working with, with Millie? We, we, we've seen her from a child actor and now the star and also <laughs> a producer of this film. How was working with her? She is a powerhouse. Okay. Incredible on screen and uh, what a presence she has. And she's, she's so good in this movie. Okay, how do you feel when, when um, uh, one of your most iconic characters um, become so relevant at a popular level. And I'm talking about Claire from House of Cards. Um, uh, from, the, from the fashion, the, the hairstyle, uh, uh, even uh, the influence on empower, empowering women, and also magazine covers. How do you feel when this character became so, so relevant? Um, it's great. <laughs> hey man, if it's empowering other women, Fantastic. <laughs> As immoral as she is, I mean. <laughs> uh, but working with, uh, with, with Angela Bassett, you have a couple of scenes uh, with her in this film, Damsel House, working with her. It was her. great. I'd never met her before. Oh, really? You know, and we've both been in this business a long time, so she's a sweetheart. Okay. Yeah, it's great. Okay, just one last question. I cannot leave without asking you this, and let me say that I hate uh, both ideas, but if you have to choose between a remake or a new version, uh, of The Princess Bride or, or, or a sequel, what would you choose? Neither. Oh, yeah. No thank way. you so much. We it don't touch to the classic. It stand on its own. Yeah. <laughs> we don't touch the classic or the perfect film. So thank you. Thank you so much. Thank My you. time is up. Thank you for the opportunity. And again, congratulations. It was such a wonderful film. Thank you, sir. Thank you.